going to be great. All right, so we want you to get ready right now and um, come on and uh, see, I just already tried to add somebody as a friend. They said, sorry, you already have too many friends. Oh, amen. No, no, no. So, so we want you to come on and join me and become a friend on Facebook with us. Okay. So, I post this on the fan page. And let me get back to the home page here. My profile page, rather. And we're going to go ahead and have you to come on to the fan page. Let's do the dialogue only on the fan page. That way it doesn't confuse anybody. What does the law of compensation mean to you? And um, Martine Mayer says, when one thing goes out, another enters to maintain and balance out your life, giving and receiving. Thank you, Martinez, and that's the First person that went on and commented. Okay, Prophet Scott, let's continue on reading right now the core principles. The life of the spirit is one of eternal balance between good and evil, plenty and lack. When, on, when one thing departs your life, another always enters. You must use your mind to determine the nature of the new thing entering your life. Good. Prophet Spen, what would you say about that? When one thing departs your life, another always enters. Yeah, you've heard the expression, the universe abhors a vacuum. Mm -hmm. And, and, and it's, it goes along with also, you know, what was said earlier about, you know, the, there being a balance. Yes. There has to be a balance. The, the universe does that automatically. So if you make room, something will come to fill it. Mm. If you make room. Prophetess Deborah, which, which, what would your comment be on that? Yes, Master Prophet, this is so powerful, and I so concur with um, Prophetess Judge Finn because it is so true that the universe does afford a vacuum, and uh, we came to earth to fill the earth. So everything mm. in life is about filling it up unto overflow. Even God, you know, we live in such a, a world of abundance until there is no lack, and this is an indication to us and to let us know that there is never, ever any lack. There's only abundance, but we got to see it and know that that is the truth of our very being. Mm -hmm. Amen. Prophet Angel Cade, what would you say about that? Well, you know, Master Prophet, I mean, once you step out and you start dealing with upgrading your consciousness and really, I don't know what, upgrading your consciousness and really, really extending to know that you and the universe are one, I mean, it's a no-brainer. That which you put your faith towards will automatically come to you. So it's about the higher consciousness thinking in this season. Wow, and wow. This is tremendous. Okay, let's read on Prophet Kelly. We are accustomed. Wow. accustomed. We are accustomed to framing the concept of compensation in, a, in our mind as payment, money given for services or products rendered. But this is a, is a simplistic version of a grander idea that misses the entire point of compensation and its relation to God's economy. Indeed, compensation is a core principle of managing your life in this physical world and the world of spirit. Amen. Prophet Thompson, what would you say about that? Compensation is managing your physical life and pretty much the world of the spirit. Okay, they're saying they cannot hear you there. They're going to have to work on that um, mic situation there. So um, he was saying that balance in any form of life has, you know, it's got to pretty much be worked out. You know, you got to work out that transaction. Read on Prophet Kelly. The more relevant, truer meaning of the word compensation is balance. It's as simple as Newtonian physics. 
For each action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. Now, hold on a minute. Um, Prophet is Judge Finn. I mean, you sit on the bench. Yes. Uh, would you say that most situations in court is looking for compensation <laughs> on some level? <laughs> well, if you look at it this way, um, one of the things we try to do besides deter people from, you know, breaking the law is we also try to, to make victims whole. Mm. Mm. So th there's, th I, what amazes me is the way the, the laws of the land follow the laws of the universe, if you really think about it. Man, mm. man it, it's fascinating how often you can see it, um, what happens with the laws of the land. So yes, balance is a big, balance in the equities. Mm. Mm. Okay, is one of the things I have to do very often. What does that mean? It means I have to try to do what is fair. See, because equity doesn't mean equal. Mm. Wow. That's good. See, mm. think about that. It doesn't that's mean equal. Mean it means fair. And that's why some of us are uncommonly favored. Because mm. that's what's fair. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, Ooh. wow and wow. Prophetess Leslie, what do you want to say about this? <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, you know, it's like I'm, I'm out of words. You know, just thinking about the, the, the uh, area of the law, there are some situations where people get compensated and they didn't even really, they're not really even the ones that really pursued the, the action. They're just part of the class. See, Ooh. and because they're part of the class, <laughs> they benefit just from because somebody else stepped forward. Like we and the company of prophets, we benefit Master Pro eternal. Oh, yeah, yeah. Shout out Jesus. See, we're in the prophetic class. See, it's a class action. When we go before the Father, it's not see see, this is where it's not fair. Because oh, we know Jesus God. is our advocate, right? And that's for everybody who's saved. But let me tell you something, for the prophets it's different. Because we're coming in as a class action. Mm. And so when we come, we get compensation for the whole body. That's why it's a group plan. So favor Ooh. isn't fair. It depends on who's leading the, and the lead counsel is what's important. Ooh. So that's why we follow behind the master prophet. Jesus, um, uh, um, mm. prophetess angel. Oh my what do you God. want to say about Ooh, this prophet, prophetess angel Kate over there? Ah, this is awesome. You are absolutely right. I mean, favor, it, it is not fair. Balance is very important. I mean, when you start dealing with um, um, what's fair, what's, what's favor, what, you know what? You just have to be in your right, your right place under the right spout where God's glory is coming out to make sure that you get what you, what you deserve. My goodness. Prophet Kelly, what do you want to say over there? So, Master Prophet, can I then say... Yes, you may. I am unequivocally favored. Oh, most definitely. You know you had favor when you sat there and walked in the store and picked up some money. Yes. That Absolutely. was just laying there. Just laying there. That you did not work for. I did not work for it at all. But favor just it. is not there. <laughs> so, Prophet is Finn, favor really is not fair. Well, y'all saying it's not fair, I say it's fair. <laughs> <laughs> it's and fair for me to yes. have favor. <laughs> 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 yeah. Oh, my, my, my. Yeah. It's fair. It's yeah. fair. Jesus. It's mm. fair because I'm in the class. Ooh, in the class I'm one of those oh, kind of my, my, my. I meet the criteria. Jesus Ooh, to be in the class. Yeah. But come on here. Providence Finn. Not <laughs> only are you in the class, but can I say you also responded to the notice? I respond See, if you don't respond to the, to the notice, notice, you can't be in the you class. You can't be that's in the class. See, that's how a class action that's works. The sense. notice goes yeah. out to everybody, everybody. who they yeah. think is aggrieved. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody right. who thinks they might have a who they think may yes. have a colorable uh, claim. But if you don't respond to the notice, you're not in the class. It doesn't matter that you should get it. You're not going to get it because you didn't respond. That's the seed. So, so see, that's, that's what happens when the master prophet sends out the notice yes. mm. and says, we want you to have uncommon favor. Mm. Oh, and yeah. you don't respond, you out. Yes. Ooh. And you out your own self. You did it to yourself. Self. No one else did No one it, did it. You, you did it. Matt, we tried. You done it. We tried to get you in. Uh -huh. We tried to give you notice. We, we even went on your behalf. You didn't even know you had a claim. Come on. Oh. That's how it works. Oh. Oh. Come oh. on. That's how it works. Oh. 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 <laughs> now you start us up. In the <laughs> you didn't oh know you had a claim. Oh. You didn't oh. know you had a claim. Until the prophet sent the notice. Mm. Yes. And Ooh. then you ignored the notice. Mm. So your claim 
You know how it is when you, un when you don't claim the ticket. Jesus. 